Yeah, I think I've I've made something happen if I can meet her. Yeah. And to actually be able to perform or even just sing for her. Mm. That would be that would be awesome. <laughs> One question I normally ask everyone that when I when I interview is that if you were um, stuck in an elevator and, and they said, look, it'll take about three, two or three hours before we, we fix the elevator minutes, what song would you request to listen to? Um, Michael Jackson, Heaven Can Wait. Oh, you're kidding me. That's so I did a I did a a top 10 Michael Jackson verses with um, with someone uh, you know with somebody who is close to him and my number one song was The Lady in My Life that's my favorite song in yeah, life yeah that's my favorite <laughs> and then Heaven Can Wait was number two um, because I'm a massive Teddy Riley fan and he, he did that with with, 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 with Michael and um, beautiful it, yeah it, yeah. It, I wish they had released it as a video and stuff okay that's that's yeah. well that's, that's what do you like about that particular track <sighs> because that's that's definitely some unconditional love right there. <laughs> yeah. You hear me? Because if God say, okay, come with me now, because later you might mess up and can't come with me, right? Yeah, okay. And you say, hold on, God, let me go. In. That's some real unconditional. Oh love. wow, that's he, really know, deep. You know he know how to de- you know he know how to deliver. <laughs> yeah, He's yeah. To deliver, so yeah, yeah, that's what I got. Wow. From. Okay, that's that's really good. That's that's, <laughs> that's what I never thought about it. Out. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is one of I. They didn't release as a single and stuff, which was disappointing and stuff. But well, that's that's really, that's really great. Yeah. You keep you know, so you keep saying frequency. So what what what? Um, yeah, when you mention I, frequency, I what, say <laughs> that when I say that. Okay. Yeah. Prime um, example, Michael Jackson. Yeah. Depending on when he's singing, you know when he sings rough, get that rockish mic. And then when he's singing something very emotional, it's like it's a, it's a certain way that you deliver it and it's pulled from a certain string. I don't know how to, I don't know how to, I don't know how to explain it, but it's like the vocal cords, it's like you're pulling on certain strings. You have to pull it, pull at it a different, a certain way to get out a certain emotion to where people can hear you. You have singers and then you have singers. Mm-hmm. So it's, Mm. I, I don't know how to explain it. Da, but da, da, it's da. like it's a it's a certain way that you can tap into your own soul that people can hear it when they when they hear it. Yeah. Over the radio frequencies, you know. So, yeah. Well, I mean, I, you uh, know, I, Butterfly by Michael was another song where he was very tender. Have you heard heard that one, Butterfly? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So when you say frequency, mm-hmm. I'm thinking about him singing normally then he just goes up in in, in, the, in the high range and stuff like that mm-hmm, mm-hmm. but even when he's singing um sincerely like when he sings at a, a at a softer key you can still feel that too so it's like oh he's the perfect person to say okay now he's when he when you listen to him you can feel you can yeah. feel where he's coming from yeah or what he's trying to get you to feel yeah yeah